15 minutes, all standing. Let's take it up during this at-home dumbbell interval workout. I'm gonna take you through a quick warm-up, just two exercises, something to get that blood pumping. I'm gonna quickly demo the exercises that are in our interval circuit. It's four exercises with an interval of 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. We're gonna do it three rounds. So that's gonna give us our 12 minutes there of hopefully get that heart rate going, using your dumbbells, building strength, and of course, building confidence. I'm using adjustable dumbbells throughout this. I'm mostly gonna be using 10s and 15s, but that will depend upon where you're at in your fitness level. Interchange them, grab a heavy and light pair of dumbbells if you have a, a traditional dumbbell set and use them to challenge yourself throughout the workout. Let's start with that warm up. I'm gonna grab one of my dumbbells and we're gonna do goblet lunges. Hands are gonna be at the top here. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna alternate stepping backwards, balancing five each side, 10 total. Let's do it. Make sure you breathe. Brace that midsection. Just ease into it. We're just getting ready here. I got one more each side. There it is. Awesome. Grab that other dumbbell. And you're going to want arm weights here. So something you could do tricep extensions with kickbacks. I'm going to set up with my feet hip width apart here. I'm going to hinge from my hips, get that chest down, elbow someone in the gut. I'm going to extend back and then control on the way back. 10 total. Keep your own count. Yeah, I ah, wanna get those arms going. Okay, our four exercises here. Theme of two here. So you're gonna go two and two with each of these. We're gonna do row and curl. So two rows, two curls. RDL, press. Front raise, lateral raise. Front squat, side lunge. Let's go through them. And hopefully you pick it up with the twos. So we're gonna go row, curl. So my feet hip width apart here. I'm gonna hinge down. I'm gonna do my rows, putting this weight into the side pocket. Stand up, and I'm gonna do hammer curls, but you could for sure do palms up curls if you want to. I'm doing it with the, the hammer position to save time there. So row, row, curl, curl. Next, RDL press, same foot position here. I'm gonna do my RDL, go weights go straight down, straight up, straight down, straight up, and then press, press, two and two. Next one, front raise, lateral raise. So hopefully, two weights, one, two, and two lateral raise, eye level, boom, two and two. And then lastly, front squat, I want weights, Front rack here, two squats, boom. And I want you to go side, side. That's where we get our two and two there, okay? Two front squats, two side lunges. Right now, this is where you prep mentally. I'm gonna start with these weights that I, that I grab, 15s. Push it, adjust when you need to. This goes by quickly, just listen for the bell. One, two. Boom, boom, get your rhythm down. There we go. Stay locked in, stay using that brain. Don't turn it off, hit your positions. There it is, first one done. Setting my weights down for a grip break. I really want you to stay locked in here, getting into position with each one. Don't rush them. Don't put it all in that low back. RDLs, weights down, straight up, straight down. Bring it up, 
press, press. I'm filming this on a Monday, same time when it'll come out. And a great workout to kick off your week. Have to think through, have to work through. Those are always my favorite, where the brain stays engaged the whole time and you're working into each position. Positioning. I level each one. Come on. Oh yeah, grip break. Okay. Let's wrap up. Round one with some confidence. Build confidence each rep. Front rack position. Good squats. One. Reset. This is especially one where you have to think about those feet. You can't rush those feet into them. You have to reposition. Good things. All the way. Woo. That's around one. Adjust your weights if you need to. It's a quick circuit. Challenge yourself. Side pocket. Curl. Curl. Oh yeah. Come on team. Stay locked in here. As we get to the middle, we make sure each rep, each 40 seconds, giving our best effort. Positioning each one. say that each time because I want you using that midsection, using that core. All 40, come on. Get in. I want right when that bell goes. We're in position. You're ready to rock it. You're 
ready to give it your all. break, shake it off. Or you, you need a sip, grab a quick sip. Long reaches, boom. Strong set, step back to the middle, reposition. Reposition. already losing it. Come on. Oftentimes we think that our, our feet are locked in cement. But you can move them to optimize each movement according to where you're at, fitness level, or even on that day. How you slept, how much strain you had at work, all those things factor into your day's performance. Keep that in mind. Round three, we're working through it. Positioning. cement.
what a fun one to get that body moving. <laughs> Goal accomplished. When I put that one together, I was trying to th think of a creative way to keep us moving throughout it. I was locked in up top the whole time, which I want for each of you watching this, staying locked in, making sure you know where you're going. And if not, you're dropping in the comments section. Any questions, any insight that you need, you know I'm here for you. Make sure you subscribe, check out the merch store. One of the best ways to support the channel, keep showing up, keep making those plans. You know, I'll be here. I'll see you then.